there. So today I'm going to be talking about what other agencies and other people in the digital world are doing right now, because you're probably wondering, right? So we've been spending a lot of time talking to people, talking to partners, you know, understanding where people are at in terms of the agency space. And we're basically seeing three things. And I just wanted to share them with you guys, right? So we're basically seeing that all, there's three categories. One is people who are really leaning in on retainers. Maybe they've like had a little bit of reduced retainers. Uh, maybe, you know, there's a less of a flow of new things or one-off projects coming in. But basically retainers are keeping them flowing and steady. And uh, I'll be honest, I'm actually talking to more agencies that are still going right now than are not and are in a holding pattern. So sometimes that does just mean, you know, you are uh, rolling on your recurring revenue. So for those of you who don't have a lot of recurring revenue, this is a fairly good sign of maybe somewhere you should be putting a little bit more attention in the coming months and years as uh, things bounce back. The second category of people that I'm seeing are actually people that are busier than before right? Let's shout out to you, Victor Vento, if uh, you're watching this. Uh, but these are my agency uh, partners, people that I know, connections, etc., who actually are leaning into this, whether that's because often people who are doing Facebook ads, right? You lose a few people, but you can often gain a lot more people in this context because there are people who still exist, who have money, who are taking time to work on themselves, who just are enjoying the lower cost per click right now, right? So definitely there are people who are using this to their advantage to make more connections uh, and just kind of move forward often by also serving one of the communities that is moving into the digital world right now. So people who uh, are moving people online or servicing online stores or things like that. So huge group there. The third group that I'm seeing is people who are taking the time to actually focus in on their own businesses right now. So maybe things have slowed, maybe they haven't, but basically they're seeing, wow, this is a great opportunity where I can take some time to actually double down on my marketing, double down on the content that I'm producing, making sure that it's quality. This is something I'm seeing a lot of, also really, really great. I strongly, strongly urge you, if you do have the capacity right now, this is a great time to be taking a good hard look at yourself, at your business, and doing a little bit of some fixing and problem solving that when it's getting crazy, sometimes you don't have the opportunity to do. Anyway, so wanted to share these three things. In case you're wondering where we at and Nancy are at, we are definitely in the third category where we're kind of doubling down on a lot of the content stuff, hence these videos. Haven't had time to do these for a while, and it's been really, really awesome. We are also, as uh, many of you may or may not know, uh, in the process of actually rehiring in the sense that uh, we lost someone just before all of this hit. So we're kind of going against the curve right now where we're actually like crazy busy, um, not necessarily because we are like, serving a population who is insane right now, but just because there's so much stuff going on internally as we kind of refocus in this time. And we're definitely using it to double down, especially surprise, surprise to you guys, processes and systems. So anyway, I'm curious, comment, what are you guys doing right now? What does your agency or your work in the digital world look like? Would love to hear. Talk to you next time and peace out.